Welcome back to our channel. In today's video, we'll be discussing the ongoing Nottingham Maternity Review, which is set to become the largest investigation of its kind in the UK. The review aims to address the failings in maternity care at hospitals in Nottingham and has garnered significant attention due to numerous baby deaths and injuries. Let's dive into the details. Hello everyone and welcome to our channel. Today, we bring you a significant development in the healthcare sector, the Nottingham Maternity Review, led by Donna Ockenden, is about to become the UK's most extensive investigation into maternity care. Let's delve into the details and understand the context. Donna Ockenden, who previously chaired the inquiry into maternity services in Shropshire, found that better care could have saved at least 201 babies and mothers. Now, she is expected to announce that the Nottingham Review will examine the cases of approximately 1,700 families affected by maternity care failings. The hospitals involved in this review are the Queen's Medical Centre and City Hospital, where numerous baby deaths and injuries have been reported. These incidents have prompted families to request an apology and a thorough investigation. Our aim is to conduct a radical review that ensures women from all communities are contacted by the trust and feel confident to come forward. So far, the review team has received direct contact from 1,266 families out of which 674 have given consent to join the investigation. However, the families have requested a change in the review process from opt-in to opt-out. The Nottingham University Hospitals NUH, Trust, responsible for the affected hospitals, has written to 1,377 families, but only 360 have responded. The low response rate highlights the need to encourage more families to participate in the review. On behalf of Nottingham University Hospitals Trust, I would like to apologize for the failings in our maternity care. We deeply regret the pain and suffering caused to the families affected. Later, new Trust Chairman Nick Carver will apologize formally during the Trust's annual meeting, acknowledging the mistakes made in maternity care. In terms of representation, we have a long way to go. With only 674 families currently participating, we don't have a representative sample that reflects the diverse community in Nottingham. There is still significant work to be done. The review has revealed concerning disparities in response rates, with only 28% of white women contacted responding, while the figures for black and Asian women were 10% and 5% respectively. Efforts must be made to ensure equal participation from all affected communities. As the Nottingham Maternity Review continues, it is crucial to acknowledge the need for transparency, accountability, and improved maternity care services. We hope that this investigation leads to positive changes ensuring the safety and well-being of mothers and their babies.